Welcome to a special broadcast of Night's Newscast. My name is Mark Heisel. And I'm Ashley Clark. We've had a great homecoming week here at the castle. One of my favorite things is dressing up each day. Here's Manny with some of the week's best dressed. So, tell me, what was the thought process behind this? It was like almost midnight. I was running out of ideas. And then I was like, we live, we love, we lie. Word. You? I have a really bad taste in women, so I thought this shirt would be funny. Same. Yep. <laughs> So, what's your name? Uh, Marcus Blanks. That's fantastic. And uh, I see your soccer mom. Oh, yeah, of course. Awesome. So, I saw one girl earlier that reversed it. Are you with her? Uh, no, I'm just, I just thought that I looked really good in these leggings and that I should go with this outfit. That's a pretty good reason. Yeah. Word. Word. Fantastic. Fantastic. Sweet. Sweet. Your Knox, and you are? Uh, Chase Enix. Word. Who's your teacher? Uh, Luke Sammons. Why'd you choose Luke Sammons? He's just an awesome guy. Um, pretty, pretty guy, like pretty good dude. Um, inspiring. You said he was a pretty guy. Yeah, he's a pretty guy. <laughs> So, um, who am I here with? Ken. Barbie. Sweet. Never would have guessed that. Um, <laughs> so, I, I got a question for you. What's your opinion on Mojo Doja Casa House? I think it's great. I mean, I love it. Not a fan. Not a fan? No. I'm in huge support of it. I really want one. I have one. You can come over if you want. Word? Yeah. Word. Today at CMHS, it's Fired Up Friday and Spirit Day. So, we're here with Miss Woomer, who dressed up a lot. <laughs> so, um, where'd you get the uh, outfit? I actually um, kind of frequent TikTok, TikTok shop, mm -hmm. and um, I saw a cute little boutique in Nashville, Tennessee that was selling these, and I was like, oh, that would be perfect. That's Midland collar, so I had to have one. So it's all sparkly, and I have two of these. I have one that says game day. So, but I thought this was appropriate for today. Yeah, you, you, you look great. Oh, well, thank you. You're thank welcome. you. So did you go to the, uh, the thing this morning? I did. I did. How was it? It was amazing. <clears throat> you know, as a teacher, I think that we have to lead by example. And you all feed off of our spirits. So when we're all fired up and we dress the part and we come in with all this energy, you all get fired up as well. So I'm all about team spirit. Yeah, that's, I guess that's what we like most here at the cast. Yeah, we do, don't we? Yeah. On Friday, WSAZ visit us for a special early morning pep rally. I was in the front row, so I got a great view of all the games and the band. One of my favorite parts is when the drumline played the trash cans. Let's take a look at some of the highlights. Friday, and it has been so special to showcase the best school spirit and so much enthusiasm from our tri-state schools. News Channel 3's Joseph Payton live this week at Cabell Midland High School with some clearly rowdy nights. Let's go Knights! This senior class, the senior class has won the tug of war. Well, we've got a brand new tunnel here, and we also had the undefeated Knights. Noah, you ready to send them out? Yes, let's go. Go, Knights, bring them out. These are some bad boys, let me tell you. What is the goal for this team at the end of the year? State championship, state championship, all the way, baby. We want to ring. We want a ring. They want a ring, and it looks like the seniors just won the spirit sword. This year's homecoming game was a memorable game for the class of 2024. The student section never disappoints, showing off our school spirit. Our homecoming court was announced as well. Now to our games footage.
Speaking of homecoming game, we can't forget about our homecoming dance. Here's a few memorable moments from the homecoming dance. The medieval games is always competitive here at the castle. All classes are competing against each other. Here is some footage from the field. Thank you for watching Nice News. Be sure to tune in next time. Thank you.